Hello, and welcome to the Tactical Project. I'm your host, as always, Tactical, working every day to bring you the best guns, gear, and knife channel available on YouTube. And in today's video, we're going to go ahead and look at my marbles pin on compass. Um, this uh, video was request, requested by somebody, so I figured I'd go ahead and do it. Um, so let's go ahead and talk about it. Uh, I got this as a stocking stuffer one year for Christmas. And by the way, I know that uh, you know the holiday season is still pretty far away, but anybody that's looking for a good stocking stuffer, there's something nice to get for the, the prepper slash outdoorsman in your life. Uh, but anyway, my initial impression was that I really liked it a lot. It seemed very well constructed, um, does what it's supposed to do as a compass, you know, it tells you um, general direction in which you're heading. Uh, pins on it seem very stable works really good. <clears throat> the uh, features and quality I just talked about really high quality uh, it's made of brass so you know it's built built to last has this uh, I think it's plastic uh, cover on it but the uh, the compass itself is metal has these nice steel uh, uh, pins on it and it's just really well really well built um, especially for for the price that you pay on it um, size and weight, the face of the compass is uh, one, one and one eighth diameters. And the weight, I couldn't really find um, a weight on it. Uh, so if I had to guess, I'd say uh, between one and two ounces. Pro probably like 1.5 uh, ounces if you made me hazard a guess. Uh, I didn't do any modifications to it or anything after I got it. Methodology of use. Um, I have this thing permanently affixed to my um, get home bag that I keep in my vehicle um, whenever I'm at work. I pin this to the uh, to the shoulder strap on my one bag. There's like one uh, molly web on there so I just slide the pin through the molly web so that I can just look down and uh, see the direction that I'm heading in. So um, I would say that it's good for things like that, you know, where you're already um, fairly certain of the, you know, the general uh, places that you're heading. So for like a get home bag or a outdoorsman, you know, like a hunter or something like that. I wouldn't say to use this for long distance navigation though, because it doesn't have the individual uh, degrees marked off on it. <clears throat> So, I would say you have to know your area a little bit, but that this would give you a good general direction. Um, so, it's, it's good for like a get home kit or uh, a hunter outdoorsman, uh, but not really for long range. Uh, price and value. Um, like I said, I got this as a stocking stuffer, so I had to look it up. Um, seems between $10 and $12. So, to me, that's really good for an actual brass compass. Um, marbles is known for, uh, or marbles, sorry, is uh, known for quality. So these are really good. I've had this for probably three years pinned, or no, two years pinned onto my get home bag. And as you can see, it looks almost brand new, you know, other than a couple rub marks maybe on the, uh, on this post thing. But that's about it. <clears throat> um, ratings uh, after use. I would have to give this um, probably an 8 out of 10 considering all the more you're paying for it. Um, to me the one thing that's really holding it back is uh, I wish that they'd take the time to mill in some like little degree markers along the edge of this compass button here and that would make it to me that would that would take its uh, uses and uh, whatnot through the roof you know you'd be able to use this for more things instead of just acquiring a general direction um but yeah it works pretty good you can see i'm tilting it there and it's getting stuck so you gotta keep it sort of flat but um you know eight out of ten i would say this is this is definitely uh a better compass i'd much rather have this than one of the plastic things like you find at walmart or something um so that's all I have for you guys today. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe so that you can be one of the first to view my videos as they become available. Till then, tack out.